The 2010 Formula One season has 305.5 kilometers to go, or 55 laps anti-clockwise around the Yas Marina circuit in Abu Dhabi. The circuit's exclusive layout all around the island's marina gives it a very unique flair. A particularly special sight here is the start in the evening twilight and the finish in the pitch black of night. After the start, you first go into a 90-degree left-hander, then up into sixth gear and at 260 km per hour into a long, curving right turn. Cornering at such speeds, lots of grip is needed to stay on the track. Then a chicane slows the drivers down ahead of a tricky spot, turn seven. The hairpin itself is very slow. The line, however, key to the top speed achieved on the long straight that follows. At the end of it, you can emerge from the slipstream and overtake. The drivers slow from over 300 down to 70 kilometers per hour ahead of the tight left-right combination. Break as late as possible, take your rival and immediately accelerate out again onto the next full throttle section. That's how a successful maneuver may look. At the end of the straight, it's into the infield, the most spectacular part of the circuit. The drive through the chic marina is an absolute highlight for both drivers and fans. Then comes the Grand Prix's next innovation. The passage under the bridge bar of the Yaz Hotel is a global one-off. It's the final race of a fantastic season. The Yaz Marina circuit is the perfect setting for a terrific finale. And the 2009 experience fully suggests that's what we'll get.